This is your team? Cool. I like the vibe. I'm Bennett, leader of Benny's adventure team. Any chance we can team up? Please? Let's go find some treasure. No one's joined me on an adventure in ages. Come on, let's go. Good things come to those who don't wait around. That's what they say anyway. Knowing my luck, the opposite is probably true for me. It always rains when I go on an adventure. Don't stand too close to me, or you might get hit by lightning too. Weather is not bad today. Oh crud, I jinxed it. Now it's bound to rain. Careful. In this kind of wind, it's easy to get hit in the head by flying rocks. Morning. Where's the adventure at today? I brought a sandwich. You want some? I'll give you half. <coughs> <coughs> Phew. Sorry. Nearly choked to death there. Hey, want to go talk to my dads for a bit? They tell the best adventure stories. You're headed off? Cool. It was awesome adventuring with you. We should totally do it again. I'm the leader of Benny's Adventure Team, a rising star in the Mondstadt Adventurers Guild. Where are the others? Uh, uh they're all on leave right now. Uh, it's not as bad as you've heard. Everyone falls into a trapper's pit or gets hit on the head by a falling tree now and then, right? <laughs> you wish. Benny's Adventure Team has had no vacancies in ages. I mean, you must be spoiled for choice, right? Why'd you want to join the unluckiest adventurer alive anyway? From now on, I'll distract the monsters and set off the traps while you grab the treasure. Sound good? You don't like it? Oh, don't worry about me getting injured. It's what I'm best at. And for you, it would be my pleasure. I think I get why you teamed up with me now. It's cause we're the same, you and I. We both like that adrenaline rush you get from being in dangerous situations. That's what makes adventuring so addictive. Getting recognized by the gods was the last thing I expected, seeing as how I'm so unlucky all the time. But if the gods haven't given up on me, I guess that means I shouldn't give up on me either. Do you want to come and see the view of Mondstadt from above sometime? It's real pretty at night, when the city's all lit up and you can see the moon reflected on Cider Lake. Huh? From where? <laughs> well, there was this one time when I got picked up by a tornado and ended up on this cliff way up high. Not interested. Oh, okay then. Never mind. I actually quite like cabbage. It's not much to look at, but you can't imagine a world without it. You can grow it anywhere, it goes with everything, and the flavor never gets in the way. I don't know. There's something... nice about being ordinary. She's the best singer and dancer out there. I always go to watch her in concert after an adventure goes south. It really lifts my mood. Chanting along with all the other fans, cheering her on. It's really kind of magical. It's no wonder she's so popular. Boy, if I had even half her popularity as leader of my adventure team. She's a cute kid, but I have to keep my distance. Whenever she plays with me, her bombs always end up going off. It's not so much me I'm worried about. It would just be awful if something happened to Klee. The Knights of Favonius would never forgive me, that's for sure. Oh yeah, the Princess and Dea for what Tailung from the world beyond. She's amazing. I keep asking her if we could go adventuring in her home world together, but each time I bring it up, she sort of avoids the topic. She's probably just worried about my safety. Her home world sounds like a dangerous place for sure. I keep meaning to ask Master Jean for some help with the Mondstadt Adventurers Guild, but I don't know how to go about it. The Guild doesn't have as many rules or regulations as the Knights of Havonius. The dads and I are pretty laid back about everything. Pretty sure that attitude wouldn't fly with Jean, though. I guess I should read up on the Knight's etiquette or something? He's my role model! Talk about team leaders, he's the Grand Master! Leads the whole darn Knights of Favonius. How incredible do you have to be to do that? Recently, though, I've been thinking that having a smaller adventure team isn't such a bad thing after all. I mean, if things got too busy in the team, I'd have no time to look after my dads in the guild, would I? Yeah. Yeah, things are fine the way they are. 
Wolven dumb guy. Looks a little on the feral side, doesn't talk much, but he's all right. We both love eating meat, so we got that in common. I sometimes cook some meat for him, and he teaches me how wolves communicate in return. <laughs> you should join us next time. Oh, I know who you mean. The girl who's always charging around all over the place. She's always off adventuring in the wild, just like me. But if you ever see her near a cooking pot, you'll soon find a cloud of thick black smoke blowing in your direction, followed by the smell of burnt steak. Huh, maybe she was born unlucky too. Noelle's someone I've been watching for a while. She's really talented and extremely hardworking, but somehow she's still a maid. The Knights of Favonia still haven't made her a knight. It's a shame, don't you think? Boy, if she switched to the Adventurer's Guild, she'd easily be one of the best there is. Oh, you want to know about me? <laughs> I'm just your average adventurer. Except I'm more unlucky than average. Anyway, I'm nothing compared to you. You're the star of all those legendary tales. What do I got to show for myself? The Dats. That's how I refer to all the older adventurers in Mondstadt. Apparently, I was an orphan kid that they rescued from the most perilous situation ever. How cool is that? I have such terrible luck all the time, and yet I was rescued against the odds and survived all this time. It's a miracle if you ask me. You've, uh, noticed then. <laughs> yeah, Benny's adventure team has been me on my own for a long time now. Reason is, I have such bad luck that... Even the most benign of adventures end up turning into the adventure from hell, and no one wants to come with me. Do you feel the same way? I was born unlucky. That's just the way it is, and I've lived with it so long now that I'm just used to it. But you know what? Maybe it's a good thing. It means I know that whatever luck I do have left is gonna run out sooner rather than later, so I'd better make the most of my life while it lasts. You know, go on plenty of adventures, meet loads of people. I mean, if I didn't live like that, I may never have even met you. Can you imagine? <laughs> Time flies. We've been a team for a while now, haven't we? Anyway, I have a dream I want to tell you about. Once the Mondstadt Adventurers Guild becomes the biggest branch in Tevat, I want to go adventuring all over the world. Benny's adventure team will be the greatest adventure team there ever was, because you and me are the greatest adventurers. Since when? Uh, I don't remember exactly when you signed on to Benny's adventure team. But whatever, it's just details, right? I like all kinds of things, but most of all, I like adventures. One day, I'm gonna find the most valuable treasure in the whole world, and then my dad's gonna have a better life, and the Mondstadt Adventurers Guild will be back in business. Huh. Well, if you really wanna know, when I have a bad day, I feel a bit glum. Like, it sucks when I come back empty-handed from an adventure, or when one of my dad's old injuries starts acting up. But they're just small things, really. After a good night's sleep, I forget all about them. New day, new start. <laughs> Meat! Meat is the best sustenance there is. Chicken mushroom skewers, steaks, and sweet madams are all my specialties. You won't go hungry if you come adventuring with me, that's for sure. You can't really afford to be picky as an adventurer. That said, I can't really handle spicy food. I find it hard to breathe after eating Dreyun chilies. Like the spice went right into my lungs, and there's no avoiding the diarrhea afterward. It's the devil's fruit, I say. Who knows where it came from? Whoa, lucky me! <laughs> oh wait, does that mean I just use all of my good luck for today? Literally everything you cook ends up tasting amazing. <laughs> You're awesome! Oh, oh no, my stomach hurts. Happy birthday! Best of luck in the year ahead. Don't worry, bad luck isn't contagious. As long as I'm around, it'll be drawn to me and not you, so you're safe. I feel stronger in every sense. Just as unlucky as ever, though. <laughs> I'm catching up with you, traveler. One step at a time. Wow, check out all this power. How can I repay you, though? Hmm. Oh, yeah, 
I know this domain where there's a priceless treasure hidden somewhere inside. Let's go hit it up! Thanks to your help, I should finally be able to keep everyone safe now. Hopefully, people's opinions of me will start to change. Once the unluckiest guy alive, with a million cuts and bruises to show it. Now, a dependable adventurer at long last. <laughs> well, I, I can hope. <laughs>